Well, hey guys, so it is really vamping up out there. It is crazy. So the Holy Spirit came over me so strong today. I was on the phone talking to somebody and all of a sudden I felt my leg, my um, foot go like this. And then I was like, hey, I got to get off the phone. I have to, I think the Lord has a message. Um, but anyway, so he, oh, my whole body shook. I don't know if you guys have experienced that in the spirit or not, but um, Jesus is coming soon, guys. I'm telling you, he's coming soon. So much has happened this week, just alone this week. Okay, and so we also put it on my heart to do the April prophecies, all of them, because a lot of the April stuff has already come true. Um, but some of these were in like February warnings really quick. So I posted them on my Facebook page, but February 7th, he said, my words will come to pass. Fires, fires, fires in the cities, Maine, Jerusalem will see fires. Well, I just heard Maine just just now, like a couple hours ago, had a uh, fire. Um, it was like another train derailment with, with the fire in the sky. Um, he gave me three times warnings for the farmers are going to lose their farms. When he shook me today, he started to give me another message. It's not done yet. He wants me to do this first. But more farms are going to be attacked. He even told me um, the states and stuff, but I don't know if... I'll I'll read it to you later. I can't go into that yet. But um, he said February seventh, farmers will lose their farms. March twenty fifth, farmers farms will be destroyed. April sixth, destroying the farms. Those were three warnings about farms, and then we all know what happened. That horrible thing. Our April thirteenth, um, with the Texas and the cows. That broke my heart. It made me never ever want to eat meat again. But just hearing those cows like cry and moo. <sighs> I'm such an animal person and I feel bad that I've eaten meat now. I might become a vegetarian. Um, and then he told me um, March 28th, he said, Wisconsin fire coming, they will need water also. And guys, if you just go and look with Wisconsin, they had so many fires recently. Um, it it was insane. They definitely needed water. Um, he told me uh, March 18th, New England Church on Fire, New England Church on Fire. And they had that big fire in Massachusetts, um, which is part of the New England region, um, April 10th. And um, let's see, what did he say? He said, the rock is falling, meteorites. Oh, that was my dog. You okay, Dubs? Dubbies, you okay? I guess he hacked up a hairball or something. Um, anyway, so um, it said the sky is, this was March 22nd, the sky is luminous. I'm shaking the heavens. I'm shaking the earth. The rock is falling. Meteorites, pieces of fragments falling. That was March 22nd, and I heard there's something coming on the 20th. Um, <sighs> okay, Lord, I hear you. Um, so... Apparently, um, meteorite fell in Israel today or yesterday. Um, so that's a April 11th. I think it, it happened in Israel. Someone tagged me in it. People always tag me in stuff, which I like. Thank you for keeping me up to date. Um, or no. So he also gave me, okay. So March 22nd, he said, the sky is luminous, I'm shaking the heavens, I'm shaking the earth, the rock is falling, meteorites, pieces of fragments falling. And then April 11th, another warning, meteorite showers fall. And then April 15th is when um, I saw an article about it exploding over Israel. Okay, so just this week alone, that is a lot that has come true. And I think everything is just going to start piling up coming true guys because I'm not lying I'm literally trying to wake people up because Jesus he's speaking through he's speaking through me guys I I don't know why he's chosen me you know I'm not special he has no favorites but he's coming guys I don't know when he's coming but we need to wake people up no one no one around me believes that he's coming. So it's very, very frustrating. Um, at least not yet. They, anyway, that's a whole nother story. It's a personal thing, but, um, you know, it's, it's really tough. And all I continue to do is just 
all I continue to do is just try to wake people up for Jesus. I have no other motives. And if you don't believe, just, just ask Jesus. So let's, let's do this. So a lot of Christians have done this. They have prayed to Jesus and they asked for confirmation. And I spoke about something in the next message. Okay. So if you're having doubts and you don't believe it, ask him, ask him to reveal it to you in the next message, because he's going to get his bride. He's going to get his bride. I feel the Holy Spirit so strong right now. So um, my YouTube is Seek Heavenly Things. I'm going to go ahead and um, do a long video again of the April messages to get them out because all that happened, a lot of that happened this week. Um, so I guess he just wants to show people he's real, you know, that he's coming. I don't know, guys, I'm just obedient. That's what I hear. Um, of course, I claim Jesus Christ as the Son of God, and he came to earth as a man in the flesh, and he died for us on the cross, and he shed his blood, and he rose on the third day. Um, and he's the Son of God. So, And he's also God, <laughs> for the people who don't know that. You can look at it in Isaiah. It talks about that in the Old Testament if you still don't think he's God. Um, but anyway, so I'm going to go ahead and do that. This is my life. <laughs> um I'm going to work on that. And then when I get the other message about the farms and stuff and the drones, he talked about the drones again and bombs. And and he said, I told you that the attack on the farms is coming and all that stuff. So um, I don't know. The message isn't done yet, but um, I got to go do that. So I will talk to you guys soon. Love you.